It's like, I'm 25 and I'm like, my back's starting to hurt more. Like all the stupid shit I used to do as a kid, like run around and play on, you know, that's just annoying the hell out of me. I don't know what it is. It's just, there's something wrong. I feel Father Time is like catching up to me for some reason. Like I just, I just remember like as a kid, you can stay up all night. Nine o'clock comes, I'm like, oh, CSI better fucking hurry up because I am about to fall asleep. I better find this damn body. I cannot stay up. Oh, God. And like 9.30, it's like, we found the... I'm just gone. You know, and like, there's hair growing places where I need it. Like, it's just still no... Like, like, there's some... There's always like, I don't know why, like I'm 25 years old, but I have like the hairiest ass I think on the planet. I don't know what it is. Like, it's just growing on it. Like, ugh. like I'm talking to my doctor. I'm like, doc, help me out. I don't know what, what, what is this? Why, why, why? And he's kind of looking at me like, uh, this is not a medical mystery. You told me this was a medical mystery. Think, doc, it is. Be in my house. Get a team and solve why I'm on 25 and this is coming out of my ass like a Chia pet. Seriously. And he's like, uh, you can shave it. I was like, shave it? Really? You want me to take a blade and put it around the gooch area around here? Huh? Huh? That 911 call, I will not make. I'm sorry. 911 emergency, can I help you? Um, yeah, um, I'm bleeding really bad here. Okay, sir, have you been stopped? You've been, uh, you've been chat? Uh, yeah, I've been, I've been a little bit cut. Uh, where, where are you bleeding from? <sighs> My asshole? <laughs> Bill, Bill, come see this. He just got bleeding from his ass, so he called that one more. All right, uh, you know, he just gave me like he's sitting and like my doctor's sitting there looking at me like, uh, you can wax it. I was like, wax it? There's people that wax people's asses like for a living. You can't pay a guy or a girl enough to wax someone's ass. I don't care how much money you can offer them. It's like, uh, how much to do what? For an hour, wax somebody's ass. Yeah, no, 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 not not gonna happen. I mean, I got friends. I love my friends, but. God forbid I would ever call one of them and be like, yeah, what's up? Diego, how you been? Yeah. How's the wife? Uh-huh. Can you come over and wax my ass for me, please? No, I'm not being gay. No, I'm serious. It's, 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 it's getting pretty bad. There, there's, there's a botanical garden going out of my ass. I don't know what the hell we want to do with this. But, uh, you know, my mom's like, you know, I'm 25 years old. She's like, you need to be more mature. You need to be more mature for you. You're 25 years old. You still wear fucking comic book shorts, okay? You need to be more mature. I'm like, I love my comic book shorts, Mom. I mean, she's like, you need to be more mature like your father. I'm like, my dad's not mature at all, okay? He farts in the room and blames it on you. How is that mature? <laughs> God damn it, Diane. I can't believe you fart in all the place. I'm going to give me a wife that don't fart. And her favorite, her favorite line is like, well, shut the shit up. Just shut the shit up. And I'm like, oh, yes, this is the maturity you want me to grow into, right? This is, this is the uh, image of marriage, which I can't stand. I don't want to get married. Um, I had a girlfriend. She doesn't want to get married. Like Her parents are fucked up. So she's like, I will never do that to you. I'm like, oh, thank God. Oh, I found the right one. Yes, yes, yes. Because I know I'm going to be an annoying husband. I know. I'm just going to annoy the shit out of my wife. Like, I'll just, like, you know, test the little mysteries about women. How, like, you know, read between the lines. Like, my wife will come home one day, you know. You know, she'll see my clothes like, just see my clothes laid out, all, like, all over the floor. Like, baby, what's wrong? Pick up your clothes. I'm not your mother. All right, I'm your wife, but you need to take care of... You know what, baby? I'm sorry. I'm fucking up. I'm going to clean up my clothes, baby. It won't happen again. won't happen again. Second day, she'll come home and just find, you know, a shirt, you know, a sock, you know, and just me sitting there on the couch, you know. Baby, didn't we not talk about this? Pick up your clothes. I am not your maid. Baby, you're right. You're not my maid. I am sorry. I will do right. Third day, she comes home. She's a sh a shirt, you know, and socks and all this. What are you doing? I want sex. This was a clue to come in and, you know, not rose petals because I didn't have enough time. Just shoe, sock, pants, dick. That's what I want you to read between the lines. That's what I wanted you to do. Apparently, you can't fucking do that. So, God. No, but, uh, you know, I just look at, I look at, like, you know, maturity as an older people. Like, older people are supposed to be mature, but I believe that no one is. No one is. No matter what age, no matter what you get, sex, you're all immature. You might approach something in a mature manner, but everyone's immature, okay? Like, if you get paid on Friday and you want to go get an Xbox or go pay your rent, if you go get the Xbox, you're fucking immature, all right? Because you can't play an Xbox in a cardboard box. It's just really hard. No one's going to come play with you. It's just not going to happen. But, uh, you know, I think all women and all men are just immature. You know how tough women, you know, see how women are immature? Throw a SpongeBob doll in the middle of the mall and watch women fight for it like they're goddamn animals. Oh my god, SpongeBob! Oh my god, we love you! They'll, they'll do it. 
they love SpongeBob that much. I mean, men were always immature. You know, we would hear the word titty, we just start laughing like crazy. So we just like tits. You're like, <laughs> God, I love those. I don't know what's wrong. I don't know. I'm I'm, I'm old. I don't know why, but I just laugh and I hear the word titty. I, it just it just just it sparks something funny. But uh, well, is that it? That's enough. All right. Well, I'm gonna leave you a positive note. Um, <laughs> Positive note. Let me leave on a positive note. Two seconds. Positive note. You gotta be mad now. No. Um, I'll leave you a positive note. I was there where you guys were sitting, and I wanted to be here on stage. Like, and now that's happened, I feel like you know you can apply that to life. You know, do that if you want. All right. Uh, <laughs>